right, taking a look right now, that's that view, promise of South Padre Island. A few clouds are blocking a bit of that sunrise coming up. Otherwise, we are keeping conditions pretty nice and calm valley-wide right now. We are still taking a look at the tropics, especially after that wave that came through over the weekend. There's another area of interest down towards the south along the coast of Tamaulipas and Veracruz. That has a chance of developing into a named storm within the next couple of days or so, about 20% chance latest estimates right now from the National Hurricane Center. We will keep our eye on it because if it does keep on this trajectory, even if it doesn't turn into any sort of tropical storm, it's still going to impact valley rain chances uh, later on in the future. So we'll, we'll keep a, our eye on it for sure. As we go throughout the rest of our day, we'll continue to see on future casts a few sea breeze showers popping up primarily in the lower valley. By the time we get into the afternoon, it'll be a little bit gusty uh, throughout the day when gusts around 30 miles an hour at times. Tonight, we keep things clear across the valley and then going into our Wednesday, wash, rinse, repeat. We'll see a few more chances of those sea breeze showers developing as well. And then we'll start to see those calm down later on. If you're heading out to South Padre Island today, low rip current risk. So just be sure you're still careful while you're swimming, of course, put on plenty of sunscreen. High tide is actually was about seven minutes ago. So the tides are going to get lower from there until about one o'clock this afternoon. Moderate chop at the bay, 85 degrees is the water temperature out there as well. Daytime highs across the valley around the mid-90s generally. Could be a little bit lower if some of those sea breeze showers come up over your area. And over the next seven days, we'll continue to see those temperatures rising back into the mid to upper 90s as sunny skies return by Thursday and Friday. Rain chances do come back Saturday and Sunday, though. We'll, again, we'll keep our eye out on the little tropical wave right there as well if that develops. Doesn't look like a washout, though. But either way, we'll return to dry conditions by next Monday.